Hi everyone. Well, I just thought I'd do a quick haul of the things I bought from Disneyland Paris because I kind of want to start using them now. <laughs> so I'll start. The uh, uh, hopefully I'll be able to give prices on things, but then I have the prices on the item. But I did have a dream, or I do have a dreams pass, so I get twenty percent off that. So try my best. Right, first thing I bought was I think it was one night we were getting quite hungry and we popped to the because uh, we stayed in Newport Bay first time ever absolutely loved that hotel and uh, we were getting kind of hungry so we popped to the uh, shop and we bought a box of these they're quite nice actually quite good and I think I want to say three ninety nine or four ninety nine I don't think I've got the receipt anymore but it wasn't priced on it but yeah so then chocolate is quite nice we bought a box for us box for my parents, I bought a box for my work and Sonny bought a box for her work so quite good, so, that's quite nice um, I wanted this last trip and I forgot about it well, actually, I, forgot. I was like oh no it'd be in the English, you know in Disney UK store it wasn't, so I was like right when I went back I was like I've got to get it, got to get it and I couldn't decide between this one and Merida's, I think, but I decided on Jasmine's one. Let's see, Graham. This was down at seventeen ninety nine. I think with a discount, I paid fourteen something. Yes, I just loved it. Slightly too tight, but it was nice. I know I wanted it, so you know. I think it's gonna be a bit of a mix, actually. Um, this time we did the run Disney. We did the five, only the five k, and we were like, right, we obviously want to take things with us around the run. Like, we need a charging pack for our phones and our room key, and we took our bank card just in case, you know, on the way back we want to sign to eat. And we were like, well, we've only got big rucksacks, so we won't, you know, we won't want to carry them around or run around with them. So we checked and you know thought, oh, we get you know a Disney one, like a a bum bag as we were, a Disney one, and couldn't find any of the shops. And I was like, Do you know what? They're bound to have one in the expo big tent they had. And they did. So we each got one of these each. They were fifteen euros full price. So I think. Can you put? Especially because you know I've got the iPhone 7 Plus. Yeah, it's like a slot so you can put something there instead. These were elasticated. It's quite comfy actually. So we just had a phone, car, room key, card in there I think. It's very handy because we held our... Well, I didn't bring my bowl. I don't think it's going to be a bowl. We didn't bring our bottles round because obviously there's water on the track. But that was quite handy. To go with it, we were told they were sold out online. Which I was a bit gutted for. But because I had, I've got the annual pass and the annual photo pass. They said I could just buy this, which is the Run Disney pass, photo pass. So those photo pass with the characters, or um, you know where they just randomly they take pictures of you. So I did that. I think because my discount will end up with thirty one euros. I think I said, oh, I'll treat us to that. I'm not quite sure if it's worth it because I think all in all there was two um, photo pass guys, one in the village, one in Toy Story Playland I think and then there's one we just don't get me started on the character thing that was just a whole shambles of cutting off lines and everything it was just an absolute mick take but there was a photo pass guy at because we queued up Cinderella and Prince. Oh, okay, that'd be nice, you know, because we're like, we've never done it before, so oh, okay, we guess we line up the character and we carry on. And then while we're queuing, Bell and Beast came out. And so I was like, oh my gosh, we've got to get it, got to get it, got to get it. So we, luckily we had this, because that was a photo pass. So all in all, I think we had three photo pass pictures on this. 31 euros is a bit much. But then I'm thinking if it's bibs, they might have just like got me on my own when I was running and Sammy on her own. So that's what four, I suppose two with Bell and Beast because there was two of us. 
So what's that? Possibly four, maybe five, six, maybe. But yeah, these were meant to be. You meant to be able to see them today, which is the thirtieth. Now I've got an email saying it won't be ready till the second. I really doubt it'll be ready by the second. <laughs> I mean, if they're up, I mean they're probably awful anyway because they're almost running. But if they're up, I would have posted them on my Snapchat or my Instagram or something like that. But so that's another thing we got for the run. Um, uh, we on the Thursday we arrived because we've been before with the uh, the crumbles. Helen and Chris, and um, obviously they drive, so we went to like Vow to Europe and that's with them. But Sammy really wanted to go, and she was like, I'm sure there's a way we could do it from the hotel. And it was like, it was like um, I can't remember what the taxi firm's called, but for five euros, you get from your taxi from your hotel to Vow to Europe and back for five euros. I was like, That's good. So we did that because we wanted to try out the Primark there. So we obviously went in there and got a couple of things. This one I've been on for after for ages, but in the UK, obviously, our closest one is Brighton, and it's absolutely shocking for Disney things. And then when they do have stuff in it, it obviously sells out, sells out quick. But yeah, they had this one, saw that one. I thought that was appropriate for our race, <laughs> run like it's midnight. That was four pound. I love the big ones because you know, or a decent amount. Um, and what else? Oh, I've got this in here. Now I'm not sure how much this was because I took the tag off and I used it because I wanted somewhere to put my coins in, my euros and all because I didn't want to put them in my other purse because I think I still had English money in there which I didn't want to, obviously can't use over there. But I want to say possibly three or four pound, or oh, three or four pound, three or four euros because that was, yeah obviously euros, <laughs> three or four euros. Which is cute because then I put it obviously in my coins in there, and um, yeah, it's quite good because we don't tend to take cash, we um, use our Revolut cards. But because we had to have cash for the taxi, we only drew some out and obviously put the change in there. Uh, also bought this because I thought I need a water bottle for work. I'm not sure if I'm going to take this because it's quite big, so I'm not too sure. But so I bought this one. I've used it already, obviously, but this, obviously this is four pound. It's got like just rubber rings on it. It's got a straw in it. It's quite good. It's like a bluish, greyish colour. Yeah, four, four, I keep saying sorry, I keep saying pounds. It's not in euros. <laughs> yes. Um, and then the expo was open all weekend from Thursday to Sunday. And on Sunday they had, um, 50% of everything that was left and we and then we could still use our annual passes so I was like I was like, I want something more memorable from the race obviously get the medal and things we went in there and they had the shirts for the 5k so I was going to get five because they were 10 euro no they were 20 euros half price 50 50% so 10 euros and then obviously get my discount on top of that so I got myself one I bought Sammy one it was this. Yeah, I wouldn't pay 20 euros, but you know. What's that? The 5k, I did it. I did do it. Vicky running. It's cast on the Alpha Tower. And then on the back, they've got the, the map, the track of what you did. Now, they're very limited. They had a large. And I was like, because mm, I don't think I'd wear it out. I'd probably use it as PJs. So I bought a large and the same bought an XL because she was using PJs. And then on the way back to the hotel, like, so we swapped. So I've got the XL now. So it should fit, you know, nice and comfortably. I think what else we got? Well, that was our autograph book. We got something to see. I think it's like 25 more signatures. So we're nearly done with the book. We've got like literally that much, that many signatures. I'll probably do a close up and everything of this layer but and we couldn't decide if we wanted to do a new book with our new annual party because ours run out in March and we're going back or have this for the year and we decided we're going to have it for years so we're going to have this for our next trip at the beginning of March see if we've got anyone else we can collect and this is just going to be like the year you know, 25th year 
so hopefully there should be some out when we go again that we haven't got before. I mean, like, Jessie we've never met. We managed to get her on the last day. And then my absolute favourite is this one. Mary Poppins, Bert, and Mr Penguin. Because we've well, always wanted to meet her. We've been, like, six trips, never met her. And then we heard a rumour that it should be out in the studio's front lot. And we waited there. And then the people that... The people turned up that they know when they're turning up and where. So I was like, oh my god, I was so nervous, so nervousness. And she turned up, and I was like, oh, bonus. And I was like, because Mary Poppins signed, and then Bert signed. And I went to get the book. He goes, oh no, I think uh, Mr. Penguin would like to sign. I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't know he signed. I was prepared for, you know, for him not to be able to, but yeah. I'll probably do a close up video of all of them. An update what we got. Um, now, this, I think I paid the price of, you know, the entry fee for doing run disney i think this is what is mostly paid for but this it is a gorgeous gorgeous medal very good quality quite heavy and yeah i love the color theming of the 5k or is it then ah oh, there you go i'll sort it out <laughs> Lumiere on there. It is very, it's quite big. Paris 2017, 5k. We saw someone talking, we're going to take it downtown. Maybe get our names and the date engraved that we did it. Because that'd be nice. But yeah, I don't know where I would have put it though. So I'm running out of space on my Disney shelf. So I hopefully find someone for that. Um, what's this? Oh, I didn't think I bought many pins. Turns out I did. <laughs> so, oh, I kept this because we went to Shea Romy Bistro Shea Romy again because it's our favourite place. I kept that. I think I, I had the medium steak. I think that's what I'm looking for. Yeah, medium steak. Oh, amazing. And I paced myself this time so I could eat most of it. I think I ate it all. Yeah. I paced myself. Um, so I don't know what order I bought these in, but yeah, I bought this one first because whenever I stay in a new hotel, I always buy the pin. So I've literally got um, Cheyenne, Square Lodge, Santa Fe. Yeah, I've got those three so far, and obviously I stayed in Newport Bay. So I got that one. That was the blue band, so I'm not too sure. I know I, uh, I do this every time. I, I you know I should know them by now. The amount of pins I buy, maybe six ninety. I want to say six ninety nine. I think six ninety nine. Then I got this this one at the same time. I think because I was like I want a twenty fifth one, but I want one that's not because there's obviously loads that are you know. Tinkerbell themed or Mickey themed or me themed. I want well, like a general one, so I decided on that one. That was green. Now hang on, six ninety nine green. Blue was eight ninety nine. Yeah, eight ninety nine, six ninety nine green. Got like that one. And then to commemorate, then to commemorate me finally meeting Mary Poppins and Bert and Miss Penguin, I got this one. I want to go to the reflection, but I think you can see. It's Mary Poppins! I thought it was very cute. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I might put it on my lanyard. I'm not too sure, because we also bought some locking pin backs. So, we could wear it around the park. Because I've gone for a, I didn't mean to, but I've gone for quite a pirate. Oh, I've gone for quite a pirate theme. And they've got the locking backs. That's what we bought from Disneyland Hotel, I think. Yeah. They were $7.99 for discount. Yeah. Uh, so I think I'm probably going to hope maybe put that on my lanyard, but it doesn't fit with the pirate theme, that's the only thing. And then when we bought our t shirts, they had loads of pins. They didn't have many left. Annoyingly, I wanted the 5k medal one, but that sold out in like the pre sales, I think. So 
maybe next year I have to remember to get that. But I was like, oh, have you got any 5k metal uh, pins? And they said yes, so I came up with this one. I didn't really, I, didn't, I wasn't keen on it when I saw it Friday, but then they said, oh yeah, and I was like, this was renewed 10 euros, and I was like, well, it's half price of 5 euros, you know, you can't complain really, so I got that one, a 5k one, I did it. But obviously, yeah, 5 euros and then a discount, which is always handy, good old 20%, and then I think this one was a very late, late minute one, where, um, I saw it, or actually, you know what? I hadn't seen it at all our whole stay, and then it was in our shop. I think the morning we were leaving, so I bought it. It's the 25th one that spins. So we can't think that because I've left it in the packet, but they spin round. And that was yellow, I think. Cool. I think it's the most expensive one. It feels like good quality. Well, they all do, but it feels quite heavy. So that was, I want to say 10 99 something like that. And I think the very last thing I have, I think the very last thing I have is we were literally waiting for the Magic Shuttle to the airport, the Express Disney bus, whatever it's called. And I was sitting there, a summy had Donald. I was like, Donald needs someone, even though it's not going to be the same room, but... He needs someone. So I was like, do I get it? Do I get it? Do I get it? And she, she goes, yes, because you're going to complain if you don't. So I literally, I think I had like three minutes to spare. So I left my luggage with Sammy out the front of Newport, ran inside the shop and got her. She's originally £22.99, but I got her for 18 something. This little daisy! She's just so cute. I had to get her because Sammy had Donald and it was just... Seems right, and we did meet her this trip, which we had met her last trip. No, we met her last October for the first time ever, and we made sure we had to meet her again this time because we need obviously need her signature in a book. But I thought like, I just have to get it, and I'm so glad I rushed back and did because when I came out, Sammy had literally got up and started walking to our bus. I was like, oh, you know, time that right. Yeah, little Daisy, she's cute, she's fluffy. So glad I got her in the end. Yeah. And that is that, I think. Yeah, it was only a quick haul. And now we did have a bit of Disney blues. I think it's hit me hardest this time. But we've kind of fixed that because we've booked to go at the end, end of February. Well, actually, it's beginning of March, the 5th of March. We've already got the countdown going. So we're going to start sorting out for that one. Uh, where are we? Actually, I'm not going to say where we're staying yet. But we've made it a bit extra special because it's we're doing it as a birthday trip for Sammy and myself. Um, I think we're, uh, we're going to sort out, we're going to go Eurostar, which should be a lot easier because obviously, I don't mind the flying, but it obviously delayed and the child and taxis and everything like that. But So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed it. And... I will be editing the Disneyland Paris vlogs, so hopefully they should be up in the next couple of days. Quite excited to look back at them. And then I shall uh, see you later. Bye!